game needed that silent intro because honestly, holy shit. Um, anyone who knows me knows how hype I've been for this game and how freaked out I'm gonna be and how happy I'm gonna be the entire time I'm playing this, especially Robin, <laughs> because I've been hyped for it all day. Um, so the game came out technically about 9 a.m. this morning, my time, a.m. this morning, about 9 o'clock this morning, my time, and yeah, I kept yelling about it a lot, um, but basically I have been looking forward to this game since I heard about it happening. Anyone who knows me knows that, um, but basically I have Sonic Nights every Tuesday, and the fact that this game exists is enough for me, honestly. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna get into it. I know a few people are coming, I know f there's a few people that definitely aren't coming because they had to go to bed, because they have work at 5 o'clock in the morning, and that is a-okay. Um, but yeah, um, and one small announcement. I'll be re-uploading all of my streams to YouTube now, too, so if anybody misses a stream, can't be here for whatever reason, it'll all be on YouTube now, I'll put the link down under my stream window, um, but I'm gonna try and get that working after tonight, actually, for this stream, because this is the stream that I want to keep, um, because Twitch actually deletes VODs after two months. And I encountered a problem with Danganronpa where it just stopped saving my VODs. So yeah. So Danganronpa and Danganronpa 2 will not be up. Same with, like, anything I've played up until this point. This will be the first stream that goes up on YouTube. Um, this and then Oxen Free on Thursday. And then whatever happens on Sunday might be Portal, might be Borderlands, might be whatever. It's multiplayer night. Who the fuck knows what's gonna happen? Okay, that's all I got. Let's do this. Um, so the only experience I have with this is that I opened up the game to make sure that it worked. So I'm going into this just as fresh as everyone else if they haven't seen anything yet. Wow, we get a lot of save files. Okay. Give me five seconds to fix that. Uh, actually, might have to exit and uh, and uh, turn that down in the settings. Give me five seconds. I didn't check that, unfortunately. Is this a little better, guys? Sorry about that. That's on me for not checking audio levels first. There we go. There we go. That should be a little bit better. Sorry about that. Okay. 
There we go. Yeah, I do want to hear the music because, like... Okay, I gotta... Why I can't, like... I'm trying to figure out what's making me do that. You feel me? There's a few control things that I'm just not sure yet because I haven't... Like I said, this is the first time I have opened the game, so... And I know for a fact I'm gonna need to rev. Yeah, this just feels so good. You know what I'm saying, guys? Ooh, those are spikes. This, this game just feels so awesome. Like, honestly? Oh shit. I was just fixing audio levels, you're fine, Robin. Um, but I do want people to be able to hear the music too, that's the biggest thing. Oh shit! This is what they're doing for the supersonic areas. Um, I like it. Wow, my controls are really fidgety, but I will get used to that. the UFO, how far away is it? Are we supersonic racing yet? Wow, I'm really bad at this. was to catch up to something, but I might have failed at it. Um, basically, the, the special stages are usually to get the Chaos Emeralds. So you can probably get the Chaos Emeralds pretty early on, if this is the way that I'm thinking it is, at least. kept running into it. I'm a fool. But I got through the first act. So 
this does uh this does seem easier than the old old games which always a good sign to me um but i need to figure out how the heck i do the ball thing you know what i'm saying oh, i can double jump nice oh god Okay, we're just gonna we're just gonna leave this alone. I do like that we get tails. Thank you for tails. Thank you for giving me my buddy. With a not shitty control scheme. Thank you for giving my buddy get This does seem to be slightly more user friendly than um, the the first game, or at least the copy of the first game that I played before. Um, actually, I may as well announce this now. One thing about the first game is that I now have an extra copy of it. They gave an extra copy of the first game to anyone who uh, who pre-ordered this, basically because the the. Oh cool, I got an achievement. Um, the first game, or this game, had a delay in coming out. Everyone knows how I felt about that when I found out. <laughs> but basically, because of that delay with this game... Whoa, what? Ooh! Rings! Um... Basically, because of that, it's fine. I made it. Um, because of that delay with this game, basically, they, uh... They gave us a free copy of the original game. So now I have that to give to y'all. Oh, I see the spraying now. I, I caught the spraying. Um, so yeah, I'm probably gonna be doing some kind of a giveaway for that at some point. Or I might just fucking give it to someone, I don't know. Did I what, Robin? You can be mad at me all you want, but no one has played, like, no one has played this game yet. So... Oh, okay. I thought you were gonna get mad at me for not doing something right. It's like, I'm, I'm still beating the level. Whoa! Another boss already? Oh God, what do I do with this? Um. But yeah, I'm gonna be get it, giving away a, uh, a copy of the, uh, of, like, the original Sonic the Hedgehog, because I have one now. Well, I have an extra one. I already have it. But, basically, I'm, I'm gonna find someone to give that to, because y'all deserve it. It's a good game. It's really hard on this. At least it was really hard the last time I played it. Whoa. So this is like our story. Like we're just traveling through the different areas. Well, welcome to Chemical Plant Zone, my friends. 
I don't know the button to rev. I love this music. Oh shoot. Let's try and get out of the purple goo as if I think I might have just died. <laughs> First death. First death, y'all. Yeah, I've always loved the music from this area, honestly. Like one of my favorite areas for the music. Um, later tails. Rip. Buddy. Really bad at knowing when to switch that, by the way. Like, knowing when to switch directions and stuff. Ooh, okay. That works. Thank you, Tails! Yeah, this is like one of my favorite tracks. Whoa, why did I die? I am not sure why I died there, but okay. I think I just got too high above the level or something? Or I got squished, or what's going on here? Wow, thanks! I'm about to die because I'm not fast enough. See the, the abuse that I go through, you guys? On a daily basis? Sure I do. I'm straight up gonna die here again. Good. I'm about to die. No! I done fricked up. Okay. I gotta get up this way faster. Or it's already here. I have to not fall down here. Oh hey, guess who instantly fell down there? So close! 
Oh, that was some close shit right there. Okay. Really? Fuck it. I'm try- I have tried every button and no button revs. I have not found a rev button yet. A jump or X jumps, circle jumps, ninja, square jumps, and triangle does nothing. Sometimes. Why can't I get through this part and why won't Tails grab me? Like that revved for some reason. And killed me for some reason. I don't know why that killed me. Did I get squished somehow there? Yeah, like sometimes it'll rev. Yeah, tails will not grab me also. I thought we were friends, tails. It's not got that up. Boss time! seconds guys
Sorry about that, guys. I am all back now. Also, if you're talking shit about me on Discord, Robin, how dare you? Ooh, we got Bouncy Goo. Oh, okay. Go them. It, I don't know if it's really good, but... I know at least one person who's going to kick his butt if he doesn't be nice, so watch out for that. Good thing. This is, so, I don't think I've had this much fun with a game in a while, honestly. Like, this is living up to the hype for me. <gasps> oh my god. Y'all! Anyone who does not know how much I love Puyo Puyo Pop, holy shit! This is awesome! <laughs> Great! 
I do not think I've been this happy about a boss battle in my life. Oh, I fucked that up though. So, anyone who doesn't know, I at one point actually played um, Robotnik's Mean Bean Machine one night, um, which is a clone of another Sega game called Puyo Puyo Pop, um, which is like one of my favorite games because I love puzzle games like that, like weird puzzle games like that. Oh shit. This is cool! Just... Look at the colors in this level here, guys. Look at this. Like, this is a beautiful looking level. Holy shit! I'm- I'm in love with this level already. Okay, not so much this part of this level. Being- being stuck in this loop. There we go. But, holy shit! Okay, I know I've only played like two areas so far, but current verdict on this game, fucking awesome, man. If I could figure out how to rev, it would be nice. That might just be a controller problem, though. Ow! That's not fair! Yeah, spin dash. Sorry, yeah. That's what I've been calling it because I'm a dummy who forgets things. Um, but yeah, I have no idea how to fucking spin dash. Oh, no spin dashes? Okay, that makes my life... Yeah, I knew about the, like... Um... Thank you, Avery. See, here's the thing. I have also read nothing about this game. Because I'm trying not to spoil myself. <gasps> that was super cool! Because all of my buttons jump. That is all that all of my buttons do. <laughs> Having never been there, I will agree with that. Soundly. Um, I actually think it's supposed to uh, represent Hollywood though. Um, it's, it's their version of basically the Casinoopolis zone from the originals, which was based on, like, gambling and stuff like that. However, now we get Studiopolis.
This is super cool to me. The like popcorn thingy. I like that a lot. And I like these little balls that you kind of just jump on them and they kind of bounce you around a little bit. Whoa! That's cool! But yeah, I've seen like barely anything of this game. I watched the, uh, the pre-order trailer. I have a PS4 controller. Is what I have. Which is kind of funny, actually, because I don't even own a PS4 yet. Let's get in the van. Um, action button should be square. Yep, there we go. There's my drop dash. And time for a boss fight! doing this yeah everything is jump um if I go into the steam menu here I can see the controller configuration yeah so it looks like everything is jump Look at all these controller settings. Not die, yes. That's generally my uh my goal when playing most games. Shit, I don't have any rangs. Now I have some rangs. So I think I have to jump on the not red one. And that'll send it back at him. That was a very well-timed bout of rangs. I wanna see what's coming ahead of me. Yeah, I can't even touch the red ones. So I have to jump on that one. That one. And there we go! We did it! Tails has done nothing for me the entire game. But that's fine. He's just there. I mean, he collects rings and stuff. A bit. Um, uh, one thing I will note about this game that's pretty cool is you can also play as, like, Knuckles and you can just play as Tails. You can be Tails with a real control scheme! Tails is doing his best and I love him, he's my son. Um, I'm gonna continue being salty about Sonic Adventure 2, by the way. It's never gonna end. My salt towards that game will not- will never end. Um, because give my son some slack. Cut my son some slack. I love Tails. Anyone who talks shit about Tails is a bad person in my eyes. And I know he's a little bit annoying in modern Sonic stuff, but I still love him anyway. Um, where am I going? There we go. That's what I was trying to do. Whoa, that was trippy. Um, 
My verdict on this game so far is that it's hella fun, though. I'm really enjoying this, like, even more than I thought I would, because I have a tendency to get frustrated at some games. And I'm just having a good time. Lock on. What am I locking on to? And I'm I'm having a legit good time here. Holy crap, that just happened. Okay. I have no idea what this is about. But there's nowhere for me to really go this way. Can I oh! Okay, we're going back this way. Oh! I gotta get up there. Okay. Now I see. We got this. Wait, no. No! What am I doing? Being an idiot, apparently. Um. Hi there, Tails, buddy. Why do I immediately fall off there? Um, hello there. Uh, you were at the, uh, adventure stream last week, right? There we go. Robin it has like a little bit of one though like it it you kind of latch on to it a little bit well welcome back well now what do I do what do I do from there there's nothing to do from there Oh, I can just go this way. Screw that. Okay. Screw that then. Um, welcome back, though. It's always good to see people returning. Whoa, why can't I go past there? There we go. 
I got it to spin dash. See how this is gonna be. Oh, thanks. I think. <laughs> with a brand new game. Ninety percent of my points are probably coming from Tails right now. Whoop. But I am already on the third zone, which is pretty cool. I didn't think this would be like This easy to get through in one fell swoop, you feel me? Uh, there we go, we want to go back this way, and there we go. going out of my way to search for the secret levels, but honestly, I'm not a completionist. I'm not really that excited by that kind of stuff. Um, oh, okay. So get in the area when that happens. Oh, and okay. I believe I may have said this once already, but uh... But yeah, I'm not very good at games. If you're coming here to see great gaming, you're not gonna get it. However, I do fucking love Sonic games. That is one thing about me that has been universal throughout my entire life, pretty much. Um, so yeah, we're here to have a good time and be excited about a new game coming out. Um, because today is actually the release date of this game on PC. I've never done a game on release date. Um, so it's cool. I'm terrible at games, we all know this. We're, we're here to have a good time and have fun, not be good at games, Avery. And I'd rather be honest than have someone come here thinking they're gonna get something, some amazing gameplay. Robin yells at me a lot, and it makes me sad sometimes, because I'm not that bad. I know things sometimes, you know. Yeah, especially people who are already speedrunning this game. Like, how? First of all? Like, I have- I have seen people... Who speedrun... This game... 
already. Which is crazy. Like speedrunning a game the day it comes out. Like y'all. I get dedication. But that's just insane to me. Like, y'all have more dedication than I do, speedrunners out there. I have full props to speedrunners, honestly. Oh, this is gonna be an area where I'm gonna jump and die every five seconds, ain't it? Yep, it is. Did you just spell my name wrong, Avery? <laughs> Um, but moral of the story, speedrunners are awesome people, but I am not one of them. <laughs> this is not going my way. Oh, shit. How far back is it going to take me? Cool. <laughs> oh wow, so it takes me back here when I die. Okay. Um, so I was gonna check my controls. Yeah, my controls should be fine. Um, but it looks like there's a time attack and there's a versus mode. That's cool. I'm, I'm in with a versus mode. Um, but you also have like 10 save files, which is cool. Um, and you can play as, I'm gonna show off, um, some of the other play modes. I'm gonna, I'm gonna show off Knuckles really quick for a bit. be knuckles i love knuckles too uh okay me immediately fucks up <laughs> so knuckles can like float basically Oh my lord, I'm so bad at this. Yeah, he like glides. And he can also um uh climb walls and stuff. Just like, in fact, in Adventure. And, spoiler alert, I'm not very good at him. character has their own levels in this like you're not gonna play the exact same level if you're playing as Sonic versus Knuckles versus Tails which is a super cool thing so like basically you have all these different levels that you get to play
which is super cool to me. They're, they're basically giving you a variety of everything. Because, like, each character has a different thing they can do. Like, Tails can fly, and Sonic is speed, and... Nux can do Nux things. It's not square in mine. Avery, Nux, yes. My boy, my boy Nux. Okay, we're gonna try and do this catch the UFO thing again. Um, so this is basically their equivalent of the secret stages. I think I showed this off like once and never found one again. I almost did. I saw both of your usernames at the same time. Your usernames are one after the other on my screen! Calm down! Gotta get more rings! Hey, how about you two shut the fuck up? joke that Robin would make. That's why I just kind of expected it to be her. This is pretty cool. I'm real bad at it. Um, but basically the goal of the secret stages is to get back the Chaos Emeralds. Just like the secret stages in the original games. Nux is going faster than he has ever gone before. time and I did not get the UFO um but I got a lot of points off my mock bonus so that's cool so back into green hill zone okay let's go this way It's not easy. Nux cannot jump as high. And that is getting frustrating already. Yeah, it is really not easy. It's the secret stages, or the special stages, so I'm, like, not anticipating it being easy. There we go, I got one of them. And I have no rings. Okay, we might not be lasting long as Nux.
There we go. At least it starts you fairly close to the, uh, the boss fight. Yeah, I can't jump high enough to get to the thing that's in the air, so I gotta hit them while they're down on the ground, it looks like. Yeah. Ah! Give me back my ring! But now what do I do with this? There we go. Okay, at least they have an easy enough pattern to follow. And I know that you can bump the sign to make it go faster or to, to get you more points, but I'm not going to bother with that. Whee! Time to go slightly fast. Okay. I fucked that up immediately. Um, but if anyone has played, I want to do it again. I'm gonna restart the level because I want to try that again because I fucked that up real bad. It was what, like right here somewhere? Where was it? Can't go back that way. Now I can't find it again. Um, basically, those are what the uh, original special stages were from the first games. Which is real cool. Well, we're not playing Knuckles anymore. I just looked over and saw my Discord and remembered that my name in a Discord is Nuggles right now. Oh, shit. That's not the one I meant to do. I can't back out now, can I? Rip Nuggles. <sighs> he he's great. Sonic is the best. Fuck you. Um, but I'm gonna exit here. Oh boy, there are secrets, apparently. Um, and I'm gonna try Tails with this one. Because I love Tails. Why is Sonic piloting the tornado? Don't let Sonic pilot the plane, Tails. Don't do that, that's a bad idea. <laughs> I love those fucking faces, they're beautiful. I love this game so much, you guys. Here we 
we go. This is the way that this was meant to be played. This is the way this game was meant to be played. No one can convince me otherwise. Oh shit, that's rangs or uh, spikes. if you just keep tapping that button. Oh, and we're doing this again, guys! Tails is a lot slower than the other two were. Just right off the bat, I'm noticing that. properly there like he's a lot slower than they are right off the bat kind of thing like Knuck knuckles and ta and uh sonic moved a lot faster right out of the gate at least from what it felt like um One thing I will say about this game really quick is that it does seem like it has a lot of completion bonuses with like those secrets and stuff like that there that I saw. So that's cool. So it seems like there are quite a few ways for you to like get secrets and stuff like that. I just want to get Super Sonic or Super Tails. I want to get all the Chaos Emeralds. Y'all. I don't even know where my UFO went, though. Apparently I'm supposed to be, like, catching up to some UFO? But, like... I haven't seen it in a while. Am I screwing this up somehow? screwing that up somehow, but whatever. I'll figure it out later. They're fun! I'll say that much. cannot jump high enough to get the the one when it's up by the way there we go there's one 
some hang out in the corner. There's two. Perfect. That was actually like way easier that time. Yay! Um, but yeah, that's how each of the characters plays. Um Sonic is Sonic. We all know how Sonic plays. Or at least how Sonic should play, kind of thing. So... I'm not gonna do just his on his own right now. I'm gonna just go back into what I was doing after this level. You sure can! I, I sure am having a lot of fun with Tails though. I love Tails. Man, he's a good kid. Tales and how bitter I am about his levels in uh in adventure because they're just bad levels bad level design guys um but yeah I think I'm gonna go back to just continuing levels because yeah they're they're pretty well the same Yeah, I want justice for Tails. There we go. See, like, give me a level, give me a playstyle like this game for Tails. In that. I wouldn't mind that. It's the dude who flies around a little bit. They even program that in. That's the even funnier part of it to me. Is that they even program that into the game. They, they programmed it into the game where he could walk around out of the mech. So like, I just don't get it. I'm trying to rush things too much and that's my problem. I, I kind of rush sometimes. Why couldn't I get there though? Um. But yeah, as I was saying, like, Tails has had a lot of mistreatment in the past, and I want good things for my boy, but that's not gonna happen anytime soon. This is pretty decent, in my opinion. Um, but yeah, if anyone has played Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, I guess is what it's called, um, and played the Tails levels, they're bad. They're real bad. Just don't do it, man. Spare yourself the... the grief. Ugh. I, 
I have a feeling this is gonna get annoying fast, having to actually go in every time. Um, just start me back at the beginning of the level, please, when I die. Um, also... And that's the problem, that's, that's another problem that I have with it, is that, like, they're integral levels that you have to play! And see, Robin, I'm not... How do I make that jump? I think I have to get more momentum. How do I get Tails to grab me? Tails never grabs me. Yeah, again, that's that's another gripe that I have with it as well, that they're badly done levels that are integral to finish the game. Okay, this is fine. Oh, I just needed a little bit more momentum. There we go. to the game and that's that's what sucks There we go. The levels are starting to get more difficult, guys. The curve is real. squished. Fuck. The difficulty curve is real though, guys. talked about this before adding 
fake difficulty to a game by having lives that reset and take you back to the beginning of the level or back to the beginning of whatever are bullshit. It's adding padding to the game. Take me back to a checkpoint. Sure, fine. Not a problem. Take me back to the beginning of the level? Yeah, but it's still... I've, I've talked... No, I've talked about this a few times. Because a lot of games do this. this a few times and like my opinions on it like penalizing you to that extent like this I'm having a little bit of an issue with because it doesn't just take you back to the level it actually exits you to the main menu which is a little annoying with seeing the the main menu because it looks cool in this game however it's kind of annoying right now mm, yeah and we're going back to that main menu guys there's got to be a way to turn that off let me see if there's a way to turn that off any settings I don't think yeah I don't see any way to change that though no no do not want to exit do not want to exit okay yeah that that's a little annoying I'll give that right now especially for a game that's supposed to be all about keeping you in the action and all that that's really my only gripe about this right now, though. Like, I haven't found too many things that I have an issue with, which is very difficult for Sonic games for most people. There we go. for good. Just for rangs. that are on the walls, the little blue ones. They look like tiny little Roombas. They're super cute. There we go. I 
kind of feel bad for killing them. Like those little guys. Tails, do not put out your hands if you ain't gonna catch me, buddy. Do not do this to me. There we go. See, like, look at them. They look like little Roomba bots. I love them. It's so hard to get up there for some reason. how this works now. I understand how my spin dash works, guys. On the, what, fifth level? Bot, I complimented you. Hey, that happened. That was not where I should have been. Oh, I think I have to do that annoying part all over again. Yeah, I do.
I love how Tails will always follow you in your spin dash. Even if he's nowhere close to being able to do it with you. There we go. Ah! I should have seen that coming. Oh, oops. I thought that was gonna be ranks. I'm stuck. I got fucking stuck. That sucks. So, one small gripe so far. Other than this. So, I guess two things that I'm not all that in with. Um, the fact that you have to hold, hold down whenever you want to do the thing is really annoying because it means that you lose all momentum the instant that you do it and normally you do anyway in the old ones but it, it makes it so that you can't really break out of it all that quickly enough if say something like that happens and you need to stop your spin dash it's really difficult to do so. I hate that jump. That specific jump, I hate. Basically, if you need to stop your spin dash early, it's real hard. And that's annoying. But, I am enjoying this because it feels retro without, like, I know what I'm trying to say, but basically, like, it feels old and new at the same time. Like, 
like it has a modern quality to it. Where I'm saying like, you can tell that they put a lot of work into this. But it also has the whole retro absolute bullshit mechanics and some small things like that where if you fuck up, you're screwed kind of thing. Like some things are on a dime and I went the wrong way with my spin dash. But, all in all, I'm not mad at it, though. I will, I will say that, honestly, right away, I'm not mad at it. Not like I have been with Adventure, or not like I was with, um, Generations at points. Like, this feels good. really bad at it. And let me make it very clear, one thing I will never say I am is good at at game. Good at games. So really, like any screw-ups I knew were coming kind of thing like I wasn't anticipating being able to beat this in one night or even being able to get this far in one night honestly I've gotten further than I thought I ever would for for the first night I don't know how long I'm gonna play this for tonight um, just because I do have work in the morning and it's 11 now and this is normally when I do stop streaming, but I think I am going to try and beat this zone at least. And the they, they went with two acts per zone is what I've noticed, and that's really enough. Like, it's enough to give you a little taste of each area. If you feel me. Okay, we're coming up on where I died last time. So that's slightly better at least oh boy I hate these Yeah, once I start dying a lot on a level, that's usually my signal to just go and get some rest for the night. So I think I am going to be doing that fairly soon. these kind of things. Yeah. 
no one, anyone who has seen me play a Sonic game before should know that I'm horrible at parts where I have to, like, make that jump to the, the platform, you feel me? There we go. Okay, I guess I'm not going for those rings. Yep, I'm dead again. When was my last checkpoint? The all important question, when was my last checkpoint? <laughs> um... here again. going this way. I no longer wish to go this way. Okay. I think that's enough of this for tonight. Um, this was a lot of fun though. Um, I'm really enjoying this game a lot. I'll check out not that. I'll check out one of the time attack ones really quick. Give it a shot. So yeah, basically it just lets you set a t Whoa, that is a lot of zones. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and twelve. Looks like there's twelve zones, which is pretty good. That's a pretty good amount of areas for a game like this um but and in the extras i believe it's just probably cutscenes of some point some type and then there's staff credits as well and it shows you all the people who worked on the game which is good. Um, for anyone who doesn't know, uh, Chris Whitehead is the guy who did the, uh, the Android and iOS versions of the game. So like, he knows what he's doing, thankfully. Which is nice. Um, but yeah, I think that'll be all for tonight. I'm starting to get a little tired, so I will talk to you guys next time. Later, guys. Um, and one thing, Thursday night was supposed to be oxen-free last week, so it will be oxen-free this week. Sorry that I missed that day. Um... 
I hadn't, I was actually out of town this weekend, that's why I missed Thursday and Sunday this week. Um, so yeah, that's where that happened. But, later guys!